For the second time in two days, CHP has reported a shooting along I-880, forcing officers to briefly close the interstate as investigators search for clues. The northbound lanes on 880, just south of Highway 92, were shut down this morning. KPIX 5's Jessica Flores on the high priority for CHP to put a stop to these shootings. Two freeway shootings on a four mile stretch of 880 in less than 48 hours. And investigators don't know if all the violence is connected. Just after 10 p.m. Tuesday, the bullets started flying on the northbound lanes of 880 in Hayward. Onlookers observed a person hanging out a car window shooting at another vehicle. CHP says the suspect fired a gun into the victim's car multiple times. No one was shot. However, broken glass injured the passenger. CHP says the victims. Both driver and passenger are teenagers. They provided initial uh, medical assessment and determined that it was uh, the injuries were very minor in nature. CHP temporarily closed down lanes to collect shell casings. And as officers look for the shooting suspect in Hayward, investigators are still on the hunt for the man who shot a driver in the head early Monday morning along 880 near the Llewellyn exit. Investigators believe road rage may have triggered Monday's shooting. The victim was taken to the hospital in critical condition. It's too early in the investigation to, uh, to make any assumption that these uh, shootings are connected in any way, any way, shape, or form. CHP hasn't released a detailed description for the suspects, but witnesses of Monday's shooting say the suspect's vehicle was white. In Hayward, Jessica Flores, KPIX 5. The CHP says that last night's shooting brings the total to 100 on Bay Area freeways in the last year and a half.